The ancient Chinese board game known as Wei Qi or Go was introduced in Cuba some 30 years ago, helped alone by judo expert Rafael Torres, who currently heads the Cuban Go Federation and Go Academy. It's a game considered a martial art of the mind. I began teaching Go to my judo trainees, and along with some university students that learned it from books, we made up the first group of Go players. Torres's efforts were backed by Cuban sports authorities who contributed resources and infrastructure to his initiative. The Cuban Sports Institute set up the Go Federation and the first Go Academy in the 1990s. The Cuban Academy of Go offers courses for students of various ages, often drawn to Go from their interest in other mind pursuits like chess or the physical challenge of martial arts. I like Go because of its perspectives. It helps you prepare for your life and helps your physical and mental health. By the late 1990s, Cuba was ready for international Go competitions in Japan. In 1998, the island hosted the first international Go tournament to be held in Latin America. And in 2001, Cuban Go players took part at the first Ibero-American Championship. Over 2,000 Cubans currently play this ancient board game, and Cuba has for years ranked third in different competitions in this part of the world. Cuban Go expert Orlando Medeiros, a medical doctor, finished third at last November's Pan Am Go Games held in Mexico. We met him at the Confucius Institute in Havana's Chinatown, a center that promotes Chinese language, culture, and traditions in Cuba. Honestly, I didn't think I would win, but I did. And it was so gratifying for me after proving that we Cubans can compete at all levels. The director of Havana's Confucius Institute, Shang Wei, also a Weiqi enthusiast, praised local initiatives to develop the game here. With the uh, effort of the academy and with our, also with our effort, we would like to introduce to more people in Cuba about this game. The future of Go here looks bright as locals spin Asian traditions with Cuban creativeness and find current meaning in this ancient game. Luis Chirino, CGTN, Havana.